The man accused of killing a Houston police sergeant and injuring another officer is scheduled for a court appearance today. This comes as the injured officer takes another step towards recovery. Brittany Jeffers is following today's developments from HPD headquarters. Brittany, good morning. Good morning to you. Well, that suspect was hospitalized after he was shot in the abdomen, so it's still unclear right now whether he will be released from the hospital from that for that preliminary court hearing. However, in the meantime, the suspect's wife is now reaching out through her attorney to the families of both Officer Waller and Sergeant Preston. And she feels so indebted to Sergeant Preston uh, and the other officer that were there to help her on the other day. Santos Mejia is the wife of 51-year-old Elmer Manzano. Through her attorney, she wanted to express her gratitude to Sergeant Harold Preston's family. She says if it wasn't for him, she wouldn't be here. Elmer Manzano is accused of shooting and killing Sergeant Preston during a disturbance call at an apartment complex on Holly Hall. There, officers met Mejia along with her 14-year-old son. They told officers that Manzano had a gun. Police say that Manzano then opened fire on Sergeant Preston and Officer Courtney Waller. Sergeant Preston later died from his injuries. Mejia says he was a hero. She wanted his family to know very much so how much she appreciated his service. And she made it very clear that if it had not been for Sergeant Preston, that she would not be here today. Meanwhile, Officer Waller remains in the hospital. According to Chief Acevedo, he had a successful surgery on his arm with another to come next week. Now, it's also important to note that there is a procession planned later today at 2 o'clock with HPD. They will be escorting the body of Sergeant Preston from the medical examiner's office to the funeral home. Reporting live, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right, Brittany, thank you.